For breaking news, go to itdisketimes.co.za. It is going to be part by World Sports Betting at DiscoTimes.co.za. In Cape Town, full capacity, my old stomping ground, my people um, welcoming Kaiser Chiefs, their favorite football club. Most of us there uh, will come from there. We love Kaiser Chiefs. And Kaiser Chiefs went there with Cape Town City. And unfortunately, wah, 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 it ends nil nil. Nil Kaiser Chiefs, nil Cape Town City. Very good first half. In the second half, it kind of, they were just canceling each other. I kind of suspected that that's going to be a nil nil draw. And a nil nil draw it was. I do think that both teams were happy for a nil nil draw. Maybe slightly. The Chiefs were trying a little bit to go forward, uh, but nothing much really. Uh, Otaranke didn't have to save too many things. Uh, on the other side of Bruce Roma, I don't know if he saved anything in the second half as well. So it ends nil Kaiser Chiefs, nil Cape Town City. So we're not going to waste too much of your data and time. Chucks and Chucks, what did you make of the, the game, sir? Indeed, let us not waste time, Gulooks. It was still made, you know, 0 0. Uh, you're correct, my brother. Uh, yes, sir. Gulooks, Hotsong, Hotsong, Akahoa, and so as well. Uh, yes, uh, my brother. Utomaka indeed. No, I mean, the point is a point. Yeah. You know? yeah so we can't, you know, uh, shy away from that. Yeah, but first half, I think they started in a house on fire. Uh, it was burning uh, Cape Town, but great atmosphere, first of all. Sabra, they came in numbers in Athlon Stadium. I remember Athlon Stadium, my brother, in those Easter years. But yes, yeah. great atmosphere all the time in, in Athlon. Uh, credit to the supporters. But come on the field of play, indeed, yeah, they, you know, that's what I'm saying. They were, you know, they started uh, fast, kept on saying the case that shifts in the f first five minutes in the, in the first half. Uh, but, uh, you know, I think it was supposed to be ahead, Duba, as well as. Um, uh, the breeze as well, they got those chances, but they couldn't, uh, you know, convert those chances. But don't check and look, see, I don't think there's much that we can talk about uh, this game, especially also in the second half. Uh, I nearly slept, my brother, here in the studio. I think, uh, yes, uh, my brother, uh, second half, you know, is, you know, stop and go, if you know the stop and yeah, go. If you yeah. tra if we travel from uh, Johannesburg to Kimberley, still remember, uh, you know, when, when you go to crickets, you know, there's, there's all those stop and go, stop and go, my brother. So you end up losing focus and all those kind of things. Yes, second half, they were nothing my brother we uh, i think there's a lot of changes uh, but uh, uh, when i see on the shift side especially players like our shaba shabalala at least uh, he tried his best and also even Mtetua, you know uh, in the middle of the park at least also tried uh, something as well but uh, and say we can't say much about this game uh zero zero yes uh, reflection of the game indeed today in cape town yeah um I don't know what else to ask you, actually, because you've l pretty much summarized most of the game. Do you genuinely feel um, that you could have walked away with something here? Yeah? There was a point where I felt Oguti Cape Town City, maybe they are the happier uh, team to get a nil-nil draw. Do you genuinely sense, Oguti, you guys were hungry um, to get to that one? Did, did, did your team show you, Oguti, you wanted the three points more? But they say there was more action uh, in the middle of the punk groups and even on the side as well. You know, uh, in the final third there was nothing. And uh, also Mario, I think Mario came from uh, with Bafana Bafana. He was like us here in the studio. He was watching football while he's in uh, on the field that's of play. So that's, that's why he was taken out from that as well. But Ngulus, yes, uh, Chief, they tried to push hard, but. Uh, there was nothing that we can talk about. Even I mean, there was no save. It was not a save from uh, Darren Kit, and also on the city side, there was nothing uh, for, Bruce. Uh, for Bruce as well. So they were on holidays uh, or uh, both goalkeepers. It was only those actions that you know stop and goes that, uh, that uh, something that, that, that I told you about. And that's what I'm saying. I'm, there's nothing we can talk about this game. But uh, draw is okay for Chiefs because they go back home with the point. For City, they always give us a hard time. You know, we don't normally beat uh, Eric Tingla. It's always good getting something out of out, out from us. But today it was not meant to be. I mean, I, th I don't think they are, uh, the players. I need to. Uh, I, I need to ask you one more thing, though. Yeah. The people from Tembisa Branch, and I'm sure people from the Eastern Cape, they travel there. How does it actually feel, given that you are one of the biggest fans and you? For 20 years of your life, you were traveling, always watching Chiefs, Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. You were always just following Chiefs on any given day. How does it feel when you have to travel from Gauteng to Durban? That means you spent six hours, spent money. Sometimes you have to sleep in accommodation. And then you get there and the experience does not reflect your commitment. So Amachita Abuya from Etembisa, they took taxis to go there, 
right? Of course, it is your duty to support your football club and you, you support it without any conditions. But how, do, how does it feel when you get there and then you lose? You see that the guys didn't fight or maybe it's a nil-nil draw. How does it really feel? Yeah, man, it feels bad it just to travel from here to Cape Town and, you know, come back with nothing. So at least that I'm saying a point is better than nothing. And also, Gluks, remember, we are the supporters area, especially from down to Cape Town. I will meet uh, branches like uh, Google to Samora yeah. and Kylie and those people. We always meet them, always I mean, interact with them. It's, I think it's a nice outing for, for us as supporters to go to Cape Town. We always love to go to Cape Town. You are a Cape Town, what we are going to do. And that's what I'm saying. They travel from Thursday, just imagine, from Thursday, and they are still in Cape Town. So you don't mind the nil nil because Nefuma Namangaza? It's not all about that. And I mean, uh, uh, results are better. But Gulugs, uh, Cape Town is always lovely. Uh, we enjoy when you go to Cape Town. You enjoy when you go to Daiben, especially this far places. You go. Also, Umtata, my brother, we, I think we went to Independent Umtata. State. Ah, I mean, I don't want to talk about the Easter years again. So, but, but, you know, the traveling itself, you know, for chief supporters, they love it. That is why they go all out. During the week, at the weekend, doesn't matter. What matters is just to go there and represent uh, the team. So, big up to those supporters as well. There you go. Thank you very much, Chucks. Um, sometimes the most entertainment you will get from a game are these videos. Sometimes the videos are more entertaining than the game itself. I don't blame the teams, though, because in the first half, you could see that it was the, a very tense game, but they really tried. They should have scored, both of them, really, in the first half. In the second half, I'm, I'm more disappointed because I think they came out and the, the standard dropped. The tempo dropped. Um, the number of attempts dropped um, and there were a lot of injuries as well. I, I mean, uh, Cape Town City, a lot of players were falling down. It's like there was a sniper on the top of the roof shooting Cape Town City players. They just kept on going down and going down and going down and they had to use all of their substitutions. With Kaiser Chiefs, um, we do understand where they are. They will win, lose some games, win some games, draw some games. It is an up and down season for them. Very inconsistent. With Cape Town City, I always know that since they were born in 2017, uh, they always love these big matches. And I'm from that side. So I know they take these matches seriously. So I was kind of surprised that in the second half, maybe they accepted the nil-nil draw. Maybe they were happy to say nil-nil, not such a bad result. So that's it then. Disappointment for us as the consumers or the fans of the beautiful game. But some matches will end nil-nil. And this is one of them. It is Kitivit Times. Also, Thank you for watching us.